Water Tower Challenge is designed to take a minimum of 45 minutes to complete for students of all ages using low-cost materials. The lesson explores water storage, how engineers work to solve the challenges of a society, and how engineering helps communities preserve and supply safe drinking water to populations. Prepare for the lesson by reading the lesson plan, reviewing the PowerPoint, and gathering the required materials. To begin, divide the students into teams of three to four, hand out the worksheet and materials, and explain the challenge. You are part of a team of engineers given the challenge of developing a water tower out of everyday materials that can supply and shut off water as needed. The water tower must be able to deliver water or a water substitute to a paper cup that is about 36 inches or 90 centimeters away in a controlled manner. Teams can use only the materials provided, and they may trade with other teams. Their solution must be able to stop and start the flow of water, or water substitute, to fill the cup halfway up. Use the PowerPoint slides to help explain how a water tower works using hydrostatic pressure and have a discussion with students about the importance of being able to supply clean drinking water, as well as ways to minimize water usage. You may also want to explore your town's water delivery system and see how engineers designed your local water tower. Encourage students to think about the many ways homes and businesses could conserve water and reduce the amount of water the town needs to provide. Teams begin by brainstorming solutions and drawing a diagram of the planned water tower on paper. Teams next construct their water towers and test them within their team. The test can take two forms. Teams should test their designs using water if the materials used to design the water tower can withstand water. In the event that the design materials can't withstand water, alternative materials may be used. Consider using small beads, Cheerios, small candy, or any other material that can substitute for demonstrating how the water tower delivers those items from the water tower to a cup. Throughout the challenge, encourage students to work together to troubleshoot issues they run into. Remind students that there are multiple solutions to the challenge and that engineers learn from failure and then apply what they learned in their redesigns through multiple iterations of their designs. All teams then present their designs to the class and demonstrate their water tower. After the demonstrations, have student teams complete a reflection sheet and share experiences with the class. Finally, celebrate the fact that these students designed a solution using their creativity while learning how engineers impact the world.